and, and, and piracy is wrong. Don't get me wrong. Piracy is wrong, but uh, on one hand, you are you are taking product without paying for it, uh, and on the other hand, uh, you are not paying for something that costs them nothing to distribute. That distribute part is the most important uh, aspect of that. If you go to a movie theater, you pay to watch the movie. Yes, your money is going to to the to developers, to the, to the filmmakers in this case. Uh, your movie is going to to the the cinema that you're watching it in, uh, and the movie is going to uh, basically support distribution of getting that movie to the theater and uh, the the network and involved in that. If you're buying a game, a physical product, uh, like I said, Black Friday got my WWE game, got Overwatch, got Ratchet and Clank too. Have very happy about that. Got it for uh, fifteen bucks, uh, fourteen dollars something. Um, when you're doing that, uh, you are paying the um, store because they make a, they make money. You are paying uh, for the cost of the product to make to physically burn the CD, to to print up the uh, any of the inserts, to uh, to manufacture the disc um, holder thingy. You know what I'm talking about. The game case, yeah. So all of that, you're paying to get it shipped to the store. All of this goes into making the product. And then on the side of that is the development cost of actually making it. So yes, piracy is stealing. Uh, you, but in fact, you're you're stealing. You're stealing just as much from from the the storefronts. And the uh, people who, uh, the shipping, uh, FedEx, any of those people who make money off of that. But that's if you're straight up stealing the product from a store. If you're stealing it digitally, you're not stealing it from any of those people. Uh, you're stealing it directly from the people who made it. Now, you're not taking, you're you're not taking literally money or product from them because this is digital. It's all copied. Uh, that's when, that's the thing that computers do best. The things that computers do all the time without you thinking about it. It is copying constantly. My computer right now is copying ridiculous amounts of data over and over and over to broadcast this uh, live, uh, to record this in audio and video. Um, that's what computers do. You cannot lock a computer away from copying. That's its most basic function. But people need to <laughs> you need to eat. So. You are stealing from the developer, but you're not stealing directly money. You're you're you are not giving them money. You should give them money for uh, the product that you're that you're playing. That's the biggest problem, and I think a lot of people justify it because uh, because they go, okay, well, I'm not I'm not stealing. Um, I mean, this is just out on the internet, and I just happen to download it. Well, you're not stealing, but if this is a game that you really enjoy then you should be paying for it. You should be supporting the developer. Uh, and we say that a lot on this show because there are a lot of developers who aren't getting the love that they need. And especially for smaller developers, um, that means a lot. So go support those developers. Uh, and it, whether it's digital or physical distribution, whatever it is, uh, that really, really matters. Um, uh, like I said, I was doing a little two sides here. Um, AAA games... I will not say go pirate them. Um, I would not say that. I say find other ways. Um, if it's not a game, if it's a game you want to try, and it is not something you think that you're going to love, it's not something you want in your collection. Find other ways to play it without paying full price. What does that mean? Redbox. Um, Redbox is a great example of this. Uh, find a local store that lets you rent a game. You're giving money to the local store. Uh, you can play the game. You can give it back. Um, Redbox is, I think, uh, is it three dollars or four dollars uh, a night for a video game. It's great. If you want to play Call of Duty, grab it in the morning, play play through it, and Saturday afternoon, drop it off, and, and you've only you've you've made sure you don't pay any late fees on it. Uh, Gamefly is another great exa great uh, great way to do that. Um, this is a way that you can support uh, you can support businesses. And you can play those games that you want without having to pay full price and without having to um, you know, feel the sting uh, of paying $60 for a game that you really don't like. GameStop uh, does some really good trade-in deals uh, every now and then. A lot of people give them, give them flack. They're, they're, making, they're having to do a business, though. They're having to make money somehow in this business. 
Um, GameStop has some uh, has a policy. Don't quote me correct. Don't quote me completely on this. Uh, Redbeard can can come on here and, and talk about it uh, next time, hopefully. Um, but uh, GameStop has a uh, deal for used games for a return policy, no questions asked return policy. Uh, I would not say milk that, but um, I would say if it's something you're re you're not sure if you really want it, um, you could you could try that out. Um, and uh, again, I'll have him on here. I'm not saying to do that and just do that and keep keep returning games and try to use them as a rental store. I'm saying if it's a game that you're not sure about. Uh, and you can grab it used, uh, try it out, and if you like it, keep it. And if you don't, you could return it. Uh, I think they have a five days, uh, five day policy. Their uh, studio movie, sorry, pff, wrong one, uh, movie trading company um, has uh, some. At least some of the locations have rental systems as well. So there are ways out there to do that kind of thing without actually stealing. And I would encourage you guys to do that because um, this is product that's already out there. If it's a used disc, it's a way for you to play the disc, give some money to a local business without pirating online, um, and which which is illegal. It's a, it's a big problem. So I would encourage you to do that. Do things other than uh, pirate if you can. There are other ways um, other than that to uh, you know to re to, to be able to uh, play your games without paying a lot of money and not feel uh, dirty for, for giving a lot of money over to. Uh, Vision, whoever you don't like, Ubisoft, whatever developer or whatever you don't like. Okay, enough of that. Right now.